Welcome to another episode of Exceed TV, and we've just got a, a short episode for you guys today. Uh, we had a question come in from one of our viewers, and they're wondering uh, around the uh, automated reporting in Google Analytics, and I suppose some of the limitations that 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 has. So I'm going to hand that over to Jason, and he's going to explain a bit about that for you. Thank you very much, Lance. Basically, within Google Analytics, there's two types of, of reporting, automated reporting that we, we do for clients because this does come up regularly. The difficulty often is is trying to find the metrics that suit everybody's needs because obviously if you're a CEO or if you're a marketing manager, uh, different levels of the business want different levels of reporting with different metrics and that's the hard thing to try to make a one-size-fits-all report. So there's two different ways really to do it within Google Analytics. One is with a custom dashboard, so that's when a specific user of Google Analytics within that account logs in. They see a very specific dashboard with limited reports so you might someone who's uh, managing social media might just want to see the social metrics and, and visitors from that particular traffic source or refer uh, the other way to do it is with automated reporting that goes out via email so basically within any report within Google Analytics and with almost all of them anyway yeah there's an automated email button that you can set up you can schedule that you can schedule it to go, it to go out on any day of the week uh, and you can set the frequency of that. You can set it to be daily, weekly, monthly, or quarterly. Now, one big limitation of that automated automated email system is the fact that the frequency also sets the duration of the report or the date range covered. So, if you set a report to go out and be emailed weekly, it's going to cover the previous week's worth of data. So, you can't set up set up a report to go out weekly that covers the previous month's worth of data. So, that is a limitation, and hopefully, Google will address that in due course. In which case, that would be ideal because if we could set out reports to, to go out to clients on a, on a Monday, for example, that covered the previous two, three, four weeks worth of data so they could see the trend over time, uh, that would be an ideal tool. So hopefully Google will address that over time. Yeah, I, hope, I certainly hope they do You know, hear people talking about it and think we need to sort this out. So uh, thank you for explaining that to me and to the viewers at home. And I'm, I'm, I'm hope, I think that gave you know a fairly good idea of... Insight into reporting in yeah, Google absolutely. Analytics. Absolutely. So thanks for thanks for watching this little um, short episode of Exceed TV, and we'll see you again next week. Thank you.